Hello everybody and welcome to another video. Today we're going to be reviewing the Ovionic 1300mAh 6S100C batteries. So I bought 8 of these batteries. Uh, I got them as a great price uh, as a sale in uh, two 4 packs. Um, I suggest that you uh, keep an eye out on their site because you can get them for a great deal. Um, so I flew these batteries for 1 month and 10 days ago I bought them and they arrived then. Um, so I used them for the first month for just club races and then I took them away to Western Australian Champs. So there um, they were high voltage and run low but they felt great at the event. I flew really well. Um, yeah, it did. There was no issues there. They, they were just a really, really good battery. I've actually really enjoyed them. Um, so now now that they've been, like they were ran low at the event, I think they were much abused. Now they've come home um, and the internal resistance has gone up again and they're feeling a bit, uh, they're feeling a bit old and dying now. Um, so as you can see from the DVR on screen, they're struggling a bit on this track. Um, the internal resistance uh, began there when I first got them as uh, about 13.15 um, milliohms. Uh, they then dropped to 4 milliohms uh, once they'd been run through a few cycles and then they're now back after WA they've bounced back up again to about 10 milliohms of internal resistance. Um, so I took a sample of two of the batteries and uh, recorded the number of packs and uh, they're now after 30 cycles back up to as I said about nine and a half milliamp milliohms at the highest cell um, but overall they're still feeling really good for as a practice battery they're um these are gonna stay as my practice battery but I've bought another set of eight to use again for club races and I'm gonna be trying out their 120c batteries for a more high performance um, race battery for big events. Um, so watch out, I might make another review of those and see how they feel. Um, I'm gonna compare them to tattoos and dog coms. Um, so out of the eight I bought, I only have six left though. Uh, so one of them dropped a cell. That was obviously after they've been high voltage and ran low. Um, little unfortunate that they dropped a cell so early in their life cycle but then again I haven't exactly treated them very well I also don't have storage to charge my batteries so it might be an issue but there also was um, the balance lead did come off uh, one of the batteries or a few wires as you can see by the picture um, but it was easy sold the job back on they seemed fine um, overall they're just they're a, they're a great price for a battery and if you're looking for, if you're anyone but a top pilot and you're looking for a great battery for a great price, honestly, can't recommend these more. Alright, thank you everybody for listening and have a great day.